Ida for saying I won't be my sister's caregiver after she has surgery. In January, my 5F sister to 9F is having rib removal surgery. She going to America because no doctor in our country will perform that type of surgery for non-cosmetic reasons. She will stay there at first to recover a little bit before she returns. However, she will need to take more time to recover when she gets back. She has asked if she can move in with me so I can be her caregiver. It would for up to four months, although she said it could be longer. And she doesn't know the exact timeline. She says our parents can't do it because of their age and the fact that they moved into building. For people who are over 50 this year, she thinks that I will be the perfect caregiver for her because I'm a critical care nurse. I said no. For one, my place only has one bedroom. Also, I spend all my time at work taking care of people. I don't want to do it in my off hours. The hospital I work at is busy and my shifts are long. I don't want to do work at home too. My sister is angry because she says if I don't do it, she will have to pay for nurses caregivers and they will be strangers. Does me refusing to do any caregiving for her and saying it is not my problem make me the one who is wrong?